All right, I missed a Friday Night Live, and uh, I just wanted to make a video discussing union and non-union. Uh, been scrolling on social media. I think they call it trolling. I've been trolling on social media, reading on different pages that I follow and stuff. And uh, uh, a lot of the discussion right now is people talking shit. That's right. And uh, one guy's post was... He went through the union apprenticeship, and if you remember the first three words in the book are pride, integrity, and craftsmanship. And he said if you come up non-union that you didn't have any of those. Well, I want to address that because I've been in the industry for 25 years, that's right, and uh, pretty much old school. Uh, can't rattle off definitions and all that stuff, but I've, I've got to adjust on how to build power line. And the lines never ask me, hey, do you know the definition of a uh, volt? So shit, I can build power line. I can't rattle off all that. But anyway, uh, moving on, I, I promise you I have pride, integrity, and craftsmanship. I put my name on everything I do. I've been a member of the union for about eight months now. Don't know all the ins and outs and everything, but I'm learning. And uh, I promise you if you approach me and try to help teach me something, I'll listen and, and do whatever I can. One thing I can guarantee you is that I'm gonna do it safely, 100%. And if you work the power lines, you're my brother. That's right. If you work on power lines or in our industry, then you are my brother, and I'll do anything I can to help you. So uh, another comment on, on a different page was uh, people talking shit. And I mean, they were getting just downright nasty with it and uh, rat this and rat that. And well, let me ask you this, what would it take for me to be your brother? Let that soak in for a minute. What would it take for me to be your brother when I'll do anything I can to help you, but yet talking shit is all you know how to do? And I'm five foot three inches tall. I've heard everything there is. And I got a little hook at home right there by my door. When I leave, I hang my feelings on it. So uh, what do you really expect to gain? Because if you read the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers, uh, constitution it says to unionize all electrical workers which make in fact makes a stronger union so to just sit back and troll on social media if that's the entertainment for your day hell start a page that that all you do is talk shit back and forth or, or troll on each other and see how hard you can get with it right um, our industry is a beautiful industry we're coming up on the one-year anniversary of the I am my brother's keeper walk across America uh, it was truly a blessing for God to let me be a part of that. I mean, mind-blowing, beautiful. And uh, I did it for the industry. I didn't do it for non-union. I didn't do it for union. I did it for our industry. And uh, our industry as a whole came together on that. And um, I just I, I wonder where, what people's mindsets are whenever all they can do is talk crap about everybody else on the other side and that goes for non-union too because i've heard people say i ain't joining that i don't need to pay nobody 30 bucks to or 45 bucks 100 bucks whatever i don't care um to represent me i promise you i've been in it eight months and that representation has has come in handy now is it to fix all no no but why would i sit back and gripe about something that i'm not willing to put forth effort to change in a positive way so like I say, I, I don't know all the ins and outs of it. I don't know if you're supposed to talk crap, but I'm not going to. And anybody that needs my help, I promise you, shoot the bull grunt a message, and I'll do what I can. I can get you in contact with the right people maybe, because I don't have the answers. But uh, I wonder, wonder what it's gonna take to, to unite our industry. That's my question to y'all. What's it gonna take to unite our industry, to make us all brothers and sisters in the power line industry? All right, and if y'all want to talk crap, do it to me because I can handle it. I know I can handle it. Uh, y'all, you, you can't run me off. I'm five foot three inches tall, baby. We can do it. Uh, let me tell you this. I'll end on this. You can change the attitude of everyone around you by changing your own. That's right. You change your own attitude, and everyone around you's attitude will change. All right. Y'all have a great day. God bless you. I'll see you down the line.